What's going on? Welcome to Asian Cosell. So let's get into this Caitlin Clark uh, game. Uh, yeah, geez. So, yep, Clark drops 24 points in overtime comeback win, but is devastated by Angel Reese's injury. So let's go. Uh, you know, good thing about sports that gives you multiple chances to redeem yourself. That was true for Indiana guard uh, Caitlin Clark in her overtime comeback win against the Atlanta Dream. And, yeah, I thought we were just going to get crushed by Atlanta the way, you know, Indiana was playing. But in the first half, Clark was hitting shots, also giving the ball to the Dream with uncharacteristic regularity. Yeah, she committed nine turnovers in the game. More than the entire Atlanta team and six came in the first half. That contributed to the Fever being down 48-44 at the half to a team that entered 12-22 and and one spot out of playoff contention. But, oh, man, oh, man, did she turn things around the second half. Clark, 24 points, helped Indiana come from a 10400 come from behind, winning overtime. She's saying four clutch free throws in extra time and scored 12 assists throughout the game and yet another double-double. So 14 double-doubles and counting, legit. Congrats to Caitlin Clark on breaking the franchise record for double-doubles this season. See that? Look at that. Giving her her flowers. Much credit. Got to give her her flowers. Yeah. There you go, Caitlin Clark. Yep, giving her flowers. All right, let's take a look at a few highlights here. So let's go. Lost it, gets it back to Clark, sidesteps Howard, she will launch. Yep. Sorry, everyone. Turn the sound down. Look, there's another one. Yeah, look how so easy she just flows that three-pointer. And here's Clark again. She's like, oh, let me give this out. Oh, I'll come back again. Oh, three-pointer. Caitlin Clark. Yeah, look at that. She could, you know, she's getting better at that, you know, three. And then let's see. Let's look at one more highlight here. Oh, she almost lost a ball. Oh, she gave it to Boston. Oh, she got it. Fire! Three-pointer. Look at that. Look at that. And then she goes, oh, I'm going to go. I'm going to go in the paint. Yeah. So there you go, Caitlin Clark. And, of course, let's not just, you know, this, even if, you know, it's kind of like a Caitlin Clark show because she does bring the fans. But Aaliyah Boston uh, came to play. Look, she had 30 points, 13 rebounds. Yeah, and I sang her a double-double song on top of that. So let's uh, take a look a little bit at Aaliyah Boston right here. So there's Boston in the post. Bang! There's the layup. And then... Uh, Again, yeah, she was a uh, pretty dominant underneath because she was just like, yep, I'm going in the post. Yep, she needs to just go quickly and shoot it in the post, not, not hang around the post. Then here she go again. Much better. See, so she that's what happens, you know, throughout the season. Then here's Caitlin Clark. Clark finds Boston. Boston makes the move. Bang! See? So there they go. Yeah. So, and Boston. Here we go. Gives it to Lexi Hall. Now, here we go. Boston. Jumper. Bang! There she goes. Now we'll look at one more highlight here. Oh, here's Clark. Goes to Boston. Inside! There she goes. So, yep. However, after the game, Clark did not spend a lot of time reminiscing about her stellar performance, but she spent, uh, yep, time discussing how disheartened by the season-ending risk injury that Chicago Sky Ford Angel Reese suffered last week. For me, getting to play against her, her motor is up there, if not best in the league. She doesn't stop working. I thought she had a tremendous year, Clark said. I thought she came into the league and really did what she's done well her entire career as long as I've known her. It's really devastating and never anything you want to see from a player. So ultimately, yeah, this means a debate about who will win NBA Rookie of the Year award is Clark.
and she has it in the bag. And all the good news that she's still performing at a level that merits that honor. Yep, and then the next game is against the Las Vegas Aces. So there you go. Looking good. Yep. Give her her flowers. Give Caitlin her flowers again. So there we go. Caitlin Clark in the next game this Thursday. So if any of you enjoyed any of this content, please help the king out. Hit the like, subscribe, and comment. So wherever you are, stay safe, and I'll see you in my next video.